So what kind of wildfire melts aluminum from the cars, melts the cars into the ground, but doesn't melt the asphalt? Let's get out our pen and paper and do some quick math. Aluminum melts at 1,220 degrees Fahrenheit. And asphalt's melting point is about 343 degrees Fahrenheit. So how in the world is it possible to have aluminum melted from the cars, but the asphalt isn't melted? Well, I'm gonna show you how this is possible right now. The world's first airborne directed energy weapon, the airborne laser, also known as the ABL. Just mounting the ABL requires one of the most sophisticated and elaborate modifications in history. The entire nose section is removed and retrofitted, and the world's largest titanium plate is installed to hold the enormous turret-mounted laser in place. The ABL system is designed to find, track, and destroy an enemy target in the air and on the ground. It can loiter at 40,000 feet for five hours, refuel in midair, and destroy a target 60 miles away in less than a second. This is why everything in blue was still intact just like these umbrellas. Lasers can actually be programmed for different wavelengths. Notice how it doesn't burn the blue, but it burns everything else. In this episode of The Simpsons, they erect a new statue. When the sun hits it, it causes a laser beam, the same statue that was mysteriously placed in Hawaii. And now let's look at the aftermath. Everything is disintegrated except for this blue umbrella. It's time to wake up, people. Peace and love.